The Red Sox and Orioles wrap up this first series of the year head-to-head -to -head tonight. Orioles going for the three-game sweep were in the ninth. The Sox a little bit short. Stick a pin in that for later. He's got over three. He's flat this is Reese McGuire's ejection, but he actually gets a call in favor. That should have been a strike, but it was within the margin. Very good. Cruz a fastball in there. Over the outside corner, strike three. Reese McGuire can't believe it, and he's been thrown out of the game. Cora is sprinting out. Last ejection you wanted lip reading, so here goes. Just go, man. God damn it. Come on, man. That, 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 that was a quick one, too. It was. Mm -hmm. By Jeremy. I don't know what he said. Yeah, I don't know if this... Well, that's always helpful. The graphics show that this pitch is fully within the strike zone. The numbers support that theory, too. Right now the Red Sox are going to have to use Romy Gonzalez if the game goes to the 10th, their last available position player. Refer to that previous pin. They actually moved Connor Wong over to catch. I don't know what Reese said to him. It was a quick hook. We all know that there are some things that you say to a guy that... Oh, gee, I wonder what he said. Can't throw one any better. Look out, bro! Oh yeah. All right. We, okay. know, what we know what he said now. <laughs> we we got you, it now. <laughs> that gets you thrown out every day of the week and twice on Sunday. Oh, you're upset. You just can't get thrown out there. So I scoured the top of the ninth for the pitch they're talking about, and this is it. It's ball four thrown by Jansen. Catcher McGuire doesn't like it. The fans don't appear to like it, but we put them side by side with the ejection pitch, and yeah, those are not exactly the same pitches. Six runs in the 10th inning is what this one took for the sweep, but they get it done in the biggest of ways. Monster home.